my computer's frozen. <laughs> um, I'm back. Hello, hello. To do a video um, on my current hair products that I am using. Favorite hair products, staple hair products. Um, and I just want to show you guys my twist out. And this is this is the second day I retwisted it on um, last night to get it a defined look. But in my opinion, if you guys follow me on Instagram, you saw my birthday outfit and my birthday hair. Um, that night and tonight, this is the best I feel like my twist outs have, have ever looked, has ever felt in my, my almost five years of being natural. Um, and I will explain which products I used for it. And the technique I use is just applying the product, but I put rollers at the end too. So, um, yeah, I will show you guys all that. Hopefully you can see me. Okay. Um, my hair was done on old hair, which is always done on old hair because I, I haven't mastered my wet twist out look. I'm still, um working on that I haven't mastered it so for the first once I wash my hair I twist it and then like it'll be in twist and I'll wear it out and then I retwist it and add all the product and I don't get great results until like second day third day after I'd say the third day after washing my hair so again my hair is done on dry hair old hair and this is the sequence. I kind of did the lock method, LOC, which is liquid, oil, and cream. Um, so the first time I did my hair, I added the oil. Okay, sorry. Let me start from the beginning. I'm all over the place. I'm sorry. So um, I'm going to show you stylers. And to wash my hair, um, I'll show you that after, but it's only two products. Um, first, this is my love. Yucca and Aloe Thickening Growth Milk by Shea Moisture. Um, this is Yucca and Biobab. They changed it. But I've been using this for maybe three years. Um, yes, this is my liquid leave-in. Um, I love it. It makes my hair so soft. And it's it's more of a watery consistency than more creamy. Like it's more water-based. And I love it. It smells amazing. It makes my hair soft. And shiny a little. I just love it. I don't know if it grows my hair or thickens it, but it just makes my hair manageable. If you guys could feel my hair right now, you'd be in love. And my computer is like blowing up, fanning up. Okay. Let's hold it like this, okay? So, um, this is the Yucca and Biobab Thickening Growth Milk Brush and Moisture. And next is a new product that I am in love with, and I think I like it more than the Yucca Anala Dickin Growth Milk, which I never thought I'd be able to say about a product. But um, this is Creme Brulee by Curls. Creme Brulee with Curl Cream, and it says Curl Defining and Moisturizing Cream Formulated with Certified Organic Sweet Almond Milk, Shea Butter, and Aloe Leaf Juice. Proven to fight frizz, restore lost sheen, and encourage hair growth. Let me tell you guys, uh, last week I wasn't feeling well. I had the worst toothache of my life, so I wasn't bothered by my, with my hair. My hair was like dry as I don't know what. I didn't put anything in it. It was terrible. So I bought this product just because I wanted to try something new, more moisturizing. And I put this on first before I put any other product, and I could just feel the moisture in my hair. And the difference, like it just felt amazing. It smells amazing. Um, and I, this is my second time using it, but I like it better, which is crazy, than my Yucca and Nile Thickening Growth Month. Um, I got it from Target. It was $10.99, but it's worth it. So good. Um, so I use those two leave mm -hmm. Um... And then, um, my shea butter mixture, of course, you guys know that this is a staple. With this shea butter, I use shea butter, coconut oil, um, castor oil, olive oil, and a little bit of rosemary oil. 
Um, and the reason why I used the rosemary oil this time is because I ran out of um, coconut oil. No, I ran out of olive oil, sorry. And so I had to use the next oil that I had, which was the rosemary oil in this. And you guys know what shaver looks like. I can't open it because I'm holding my computer. Um, okay, so I did the yucca and olive thickening growth milk, creme brulee, my shea butter, and then lastly, um, this is the gel. You could use Eco Styler gel. I tried on my last birthday twist out. It was the argan argan oil formula, or um, in here the more green one is icy fantasia gel it's by icy fantasia and it's the olive oil formula and i just had that because i couldn't find the um equal solar gel so i put it in this small container um the the icy fantasia gel the one that i have is like really big and i don't that's too much to like walk around and whatever have on you so this is like a smaller container I put it in but I love this the gel and I feel like the gel mixed with the creme brulee they're making my hair so shiny so soft like it's amazing um it feels good it looks good it's just amazing um you could add mm -hmm. olive oil I mean sorry um, rosemary oil or some type of oil like usually I have to put an oil to take out my hair but I've noticed that when I did these two um, um, I think it's messed up when I did these two twist outs that I didn't need any oil they were, my hair is just so moisturized so soft it's a little oily if you touch it you have like a film on your hands but I feel like my hair needs that and I'll just wash my hands or have like a moisturized hand. I don't care. Um, I know a lot of people don't like the oily feel, but without the oily feel in my hair, my hair won't look or feel good. It'll break. I need all the oil and moisture that I can get. Um, so as far as washing, those are my styling products. Let me see if there's anything else. I do still love the um, Coconut Curling Cream by Cantu Shea Butter. This is really good, um, but the crown blue light is beating that, so I don't feel like I need this right now. But I do love this, and I would repurchase it. Um, I also use water occasionally, but um, sorry, I also use water, but my um, Shea Moisture um, Yucca Nalk and Growth Milk. Um, once my hair is dry, like I don't want to like wet it too much, so this serves as like my watery basis um if my hair was wet like a wet twist up um i would spray some water but when it's dry i want my hair to be as stretched as possible and not add too much water but i do occasionally use water um and that is all oh sorry to wash my hair um i just use coconut i mean i just use conditioner and i use the same um, herbal essences hello hydration that I've been using forever in the blue bottle conditioner and I also have started using Tresemme Naturals conditioner um, and I will grab them for you so you know how they look okay so this is how they look both conditioners that I use for my hair to wash it and I'm I like I'll first I'll put a pump of this and then I'll put a spurt of this and I put it all over my hair and I for um take a comb from the bottom to the top I um, massage my scalp with it and that's how I wash my hair um and I wash my hair once a month I know people think that's disgusting or crazy but it works for me I have too much hair to um, wash every two weeks or a week. Um, and if you guys want a quick length check, I'll be five years natural in August. And so um, I will show you. And I have a white shirt on, so it helps. Okay, so I'll take it from the back of my hair. Okay, 
this fan on my computer. Okay, okay let's do the back. This is from the back. I am almost reaching my butt. I am almost um, waistline. So here is my waist and my penny line. <laughs> and I am a couple of inches away. And I straighten my hair once a year, but I haven't straightened it this year. Um, and that's really all. I want to thank you guys for watching and supporting me, and I will be back with more videos. Um, to get this look, I did it on old hair. Yes, old hair. And I did the purple perm rods in the front, maybe like four on this side. And because I have this side sweat bang, maybe like six on this side. And then the rest were the pale, tan colored perm rods. So the purple on the front and the pale tan colored in the back. And I don't want to make this video too long, but thank you guys for watching. I had to share. I love this so much. This is a staple now. Okay?